NATO countries could send troops to Ukraine. A number of NATO countries could send troops to Ukraine if the war-torn country is not given security guarantees at the forthcoming summit, Anders Rasmussen, a former Secretary General, has warned. It was reported by the Guardian media outlet. According to Anders Rasmussen, even if such guarantees were not agreed, members of the alliance would not allow the issue of Ukraine's future NATO membership to be kept off the agenda at the Vilnius summit in July. Rasmussen said, if NATO cannot agree on a clear path forward for Ukraine, there is a clear possibility that some countries individually might take action. We know that Poland is very engaged in providing concrete assistance to Ukraine. And I wouldn't exclude the possibility that Poland would engage even stronger in this context on a national basis and be followed by the Baltic states, maybe including the possibility of troops on the ground. I think the Poles would seriously consider going in and assemble a coalition of the willing if Ukraine doesn't get anything in Vilnius. We shouldn't underestimate the Polish feelings. The Poles feel that for too long, Western Europe did not listen to their warnings against the true Russian mentality, he added. He said it would be entirely legal for Ukraine to seek such military assistance. Rasmussen said it was imperative that Ukraine should receive written security guarantees, preferably before the summit, but outside the NATO framework. These need to cover the intelligence sharing, joint Ukraine training, enhanced ammunition production, NATO interoperability, and a supply of arms sufficient to deter Russia from a further attack.